Hey guys, it's Austin. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're excited to talk about a new product for you, and that is our tree stand Versa hangers. So guys, the tree stand Versa hangers, it stemmed from the idea of this Versa hanger concept that we made for saddle hunters to attach their saddle through their molly webbing. We wanted a simple, easy method for guys who are running tree stands for their mobile setup. So what it is, is, is two, it's gonna be four pieces. You're gonna have two bolts, your Versa hanger portion, and then on the other side, your second plastic piece that's printed is this block right here that has threads tapped into it. So basically you have two bolts that slide through this Versa hanger portion, and then you basically screw them into the block that is tapped for you guys. So then that physically mounts them on your stand. Um, so some pointers that I would like to point out for any of the stands, I would slide them as further, further way down so you're not reaching up your back and trying to get sticks out of them. We'll kind of show that in a little bit. But these are super easy to install. Again, it's two pieces that you basically sandwich together and then you put a bolt in there, two bolts, and then you're done. So let's kind of walk through how we do this and I'll show the three different options that we have available for you guys. So guys, I have the B stand on my back. I have two different sticks. I have one with Custom Gears compact stick, uh, single step stick, and then I have the Beast mini stick. These Versa hangers will work for any style of stick on the market other than uh, the hawk sticks and the api stick just because of the fact that the versa button shaft is so much larger than a typical versa button which is like a half inch in diameter so how it works you can kind of see this one's on my side um what you'll do is you'll basically just reach back find the hook and you just drop it in there and then that's what it looks like when it's in there um, these versa hangers are designed for when guys are ascending the tree i don't expect anybody to walk through the woods like this because um, as you walk through the woods it's it's kind of sticking out a ways it's just not a very clean system to walk through the woods like this um, so again how i like to run these is i like to put the one on my right side has the opening to uh, my front of my body that way i can easily grab the stick by the versa button and then find the hook and just slide it in there just like that and then let the gravity kind of take the weight of the stick again so for this beast mini stick i'll just reach back there so you can kind of see the hook right there Let's reach back there, find the hook, and then I'll just pull back, let it drop down into the hook hanger, and then it's good to go. So as I climb, this is kind of like the concept. As you climb a tree and whatnot, you'll just reach back and just kind of pull it out. And as you descend the tree, you just reach back, find the hook, drop it in there, and let it let it fall down. Um, I don't have any of my stand stealth strip because I don't typically tree stand hunt, um, so I haven't spent the time to stealth strip my stand. But I would definitely do that because as you climb you'll notice this wiggles in there freely. So I would just stealth strip the side of my stand, which I think most guys are doing or putting some sort of silencing type of uh, tape on there. So again, you just kind of reach back. I like to, I like to personally twist it to bring it out. Um, just seems like it's a little bit more controlled um, that way. So for the B stick, it's the same kind of concept. You basically just find it. I like to twist it up like that and it comes right out. Um, and then as you're descending the tree, you're taking a stick off, you just reach back, find that hook, let it drop in there, let it come down. Um, yeah, so that's, that's pretty much the concept. It doesn't really interact with my body as I climb. It doesn't, I don't feel it hitting the side of me or my back, my leg, and you kind of see where that's kind of setting right there. Um, so I feel it from time to time, but you got to remember your body, so you're going to be stepping up. Your, your shape of your body is gonna be like this as you're climbing tree. So your feet are gonna be towards the tree and then your butt is gonna be pushing this out. So you're really not gonna feel that stick swinging and hitting you cause it's not going to. Um, so that's our tree stand Versa hangers um, on the B stick. Let's show you guys what they look like on the Lone Wolf Custom Gear and the Novix Hilo. So here's the 0.5 by Lone Wolf Custom Gear. You can kind of see it's bolted on there and over here. Um, you can kind of see there's a gap here, which I designed these to stick out further so they don't interact with this, uh, especially if you have paracord like I do for a cobra, cobra weave. Um, I just kind of designed them to stick out a little bit further. So how they work on this one, swap it over to this side so you can kind of see, because this is the way it's going to be facing you. You basically just, see if we can get this, it's just going to slide in just like that and then kind of come out. But you can kind of see the shape of it like this. It's pretty easy to figure out a way to get it on and off. Um, I actually designed my compact sticks to have a little verse button designed to that little gap right there. 
So when I run the 0.5 in these compact sticks, I just hang it like that. So it's straight down and whatnot. Then it comes out really easy just like that. So that's the 0.5. Um, there is a difference between the 0.5 and the B stand and the Hilo. Um, so make sure you order the correct one based on the stand that you're using. They're not interchangeable. And the reason for that is that thickness of the stand right here. So that one's much thicker. If you look at the B stand, you can see how thin that is. So we had to design it very differently. Thick, thin. And then the Hilo, this one's very different. There's an angle to this casting here. So you can kind of see on this side, it's probably be easier. We actually designed this cap to follow the angle of the, the Hilo. So again, very, very similar in design concept. Um, I don't have backpack straps on this one, so I won't show you guys what it looks like on my back, but that's basically the concept on the Hilo. Anyways, guys, that's our tree stand versus hangers. I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. Remember, these tree stand versus hangers are for just basically ascending and descending the tree, um, not for something that you're going to be using, uh, carrying your sticks out in the woods as you go to your spot to hunt. So hopefully this was helpful, but if you have any questions, remember, leave them down below, and don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel because we have lots more videos to introduce to you guys.